Oh, welcome back to Two Cannon Fodder, the channel for Arsenal fans all over this world. Welcome to another segment of a, a player profile segment. Uh, this one, before I get into, into this one, make sure you subscribe to Cannon Fodder TV. Hit the bell notification button so you can receive all the latest news right here on Cannon Fodder TV. Well, I'm back at the Emirates, even though it's not my, my preferred stadium. I'm back um, to do the player segment profile here. And um, this player for me defined what it was for me to be an Arsenal supporter back in the 70s, even though I was kind of had my head deep in, uh, in cricket as well. But this player here, where is he? Liam Brady. This was the player there who meant literally so much to me. So much, you guys cannot believe it. You know, forget about Burkamp. Forget about Thierry Henry. This guy here, literally, was the real deal. Liam Chippy Brady. Liam Brady, born 13th of February 1956, is an Irish former footballer who also had a spell as assistant manager of the Republic of Ireland national football team between 2008 to 2010. Brady was a talented offensive midfielder renowned for his left foot and elegant technical skills such as his high quality passing, vision and close control which made him an excellent playmaker. He combined these skills with magnificent tenacity, an eye for goal from midfield, an accurate penalty taken. In addition to his footballing ability, Brady also stood out throughout his career from his professionalism. He found success both in England with Arsenal, where he won the FA Cup in 1979, and in Italy with Juventus, winning two Serie A titles Brady was altogether capped 72 times for the Irish national team. Brady went on to manage two clubs, Celtic and then Brighton, together with being the assistant manager of Ireland's national team. He also held the post of head of youth development at Arsenal from 1996 until 2013. Brady started his career at Arsenal moving to London to join the side on schoolboy forms in 1971 at the age of just 15. He turned professional on his 17th birthday in 1973 and made his debut on the 6th of October 1973 against Birmingham City as a substitute for Jeff Brockley and put in an assured performance. However, his next match in a North London derby against Tottenham Hotspur Brady had a poor match. Bertie Mee decided from then on to use the young Irishman sparingly for the time being. Brady ended the 1973-74 season with 13 appearances, four of them a substitute to his name. In the 1974-75 season, Brady was a first-team regular at Arsenal and shone as a rare light in a side that hovered close to relegation for a couple of seasons in the mid-1970s. With the appointment of Terry Neal as manager and the return of Don Howe as coach, Brady found his best form. His passing provided the ammunition for Arsenal's front men such as Malcolm McDonald and Frank Stapleton and Arsenal reached three FA Cup finals in a row between 1978 and 1980. Arsenal won only the middle of the three against Manchester United in 1979 final, with Brady starting the move that ended in Alan Sunderland's famous last-minute winner. Brady was at his peak of Arsenal form by now, as shown by one of his best goals for Arsenal. Having disposed of Peter Taylor, he flighted a looping curl shot from the edge of the penalty area into the top corner in a 5-0 win against Tottenham Hotspurs on the 23rd of December 1978. During this time, he was voted the club's player of the year three times and chosen as the PFA Players Player of the Year in 1979. Being from Ireland, he was the first foreign player to win the award. He was the most talented player in what was then a promising young Arsenal side, which was looking to consistently challenge for the honours, such as Division One title. Despite this, by the season 1979-80 season, 
rumour was rife that Brady would be leaving the club in search of a fresh challenge. That season, Arsenal reached the Cup Winners' Cup final, losing to Valencia on penalties, having beaten Juventus 2-1 over the two legs in the semi-finals. Brady's performance in the tie impressed the Italian giants, and in 1980, close season, they signed him for just over £500,000, becoming the first foreign player to sign for the club since the Italian borders were reopened for foreign transfers in 1980. Brady made his debut for Ireland on the 3rd of October 1974 in a 3-0 win over the Soviet Union at Daly Mount Park in the Europa Championship qualifier. Brady had claimed his favourite international goal was against Brazil in 1987. He won 72 international caps for Republic of Ireland with 70 within the starting lineup, scoring 9 goals. For Arsenal though, Brady is remembered as one of Arsenal's all-time greats, playing 307 matches for the Gunners, scoring 59 goals, setting up many more assists. <laughs>